Welcome to Das Geek. Let's play some Hero Siege. Hero Siege is a hack and slash game with roguelike and RPG elements. Annihilate hordes of enemies. Grow your talent tree, grind better loot, and explore up to seven acts. Enhanced beautiful pixel art graphics. This game offers countless hours. Countless! Nobody has been able to count them. It's like, how many licks is it taking to get to the center of a Tootsie Pop? Nobody knows because they always bite it first. Nobody knows how many hours you can play this game for. Up to four players online in their multiplayer. This is a really fun game. You're going to enjoy it. So let's get in there and check it out. All right. So here we are. Let's get into my game here. We're going to do one player. We're going to use my Viking, the DOS Geek Viking. Let's see where we're a really fun game. No lands are safe from the blood of the north. Remember that. Really fun game if you like Diablo and those type of games. This is a really fun take on that. Using the Steam controller here. Why would you use the Steam controller? And of course, like any good RPG, you gotta have the slime creature. Kind of like the little slime creature we're developing on the game development segment. We do. No, a monster treasure chest. Missing teeth. It's like a redneck monster treasure chest. Alright. Collect lots of loot. Level up your character. Give me your gold. They've got lots of uh, special effects. You can see the monsters. Kind of like in an MMO where they've got uh, various levels to them. You got a purple one here, a little more rare, I'm guessing. Teal one here, so you get different things. Ooh, I found a key. Oh, I just need to find a treasure chest. There are a bunch of different classes you can choose from. So you don't have to go Viking. Of course I went Viking. And that's my heritage. One day when I get around to doing my ancestry uh, video, you'll see. You'll see just how Viking I am. Alright, here we go. An orange slime champion. Champion of the slimes has gone down. Uh oh, we got lots of stuff here. What, what's going on here? Hi. Daddy likes. Good lord. Let's see if we can find a dungeon here. I'm looking for a dungeon. Oh, and like Zelda, you can go chop through the ferns and find gold and stuff. Pretty cool. This is just one of those great casual games, and then if you have a friend over and you guys want to play something, especially if you got Steam Link. Hooked up, you can play from the TV, hook up two controllers, stream it from your computer, uh, have an absolute blast. Great game for the weekend. Great game to show off how fun using the Steam Link and Linux and all that is. It's not an expensive game at all, and I could definitely see. I can talk my brother into uh, coming over and uh, hooking up a controller here. We could have a blast with this game. He's as loot greedy as me, so we'd probably never make it very far, but we'd be loaded up on the loot. And it's a 
support and you level up, you notice you're not um, doing as much damage as you expect. It's taking a lot longer to kill these enemies. Probably time to take some seconds and actually level up, which you could do here. So uh, you've got a rune section, which I finally have one rune there. What's that do? Armor plus 0.20% and level two. Pretty cool. And uh, some talents here, so we can increase our damage. Mana, if you're magical, damage reduction. I'll put one in health. Some, put a lot in damage. And then if you want to uh, see your all the loot you've gathered up here, we can check out if we have anything better. That looks much better. Yeah. Go with that. One requires level nine. Nine. What a level nine gear here. Uh oh. Use one of my potions. It's got potions in the left hand corner as well as special items you can equip. Uh oh, boss encounter. Where's the boss at? I don't see no boss. Bring him. Oh, it's got a little arrow. They thought of everything in this game. Where is that boss at? Bring it. Bring it. Oh yeah. What you got for me? What you got for me? Oh, ah, ah, get out of this. No, what am I doing? Get out. Get out. Out. Oh, my terrible skills. All right, right stick. Heal up. Oh, I'm gonna have to cut that out of the video. There's no way I'm gonna let you guys see. I thought I switched the controls, so the buttons are something. Trust me. This isn't my fault. Oh my gosh, the controls are killing me. <sighs> yeah, put on a cap, you moron. I, I don't like the way the controls are set up. It's not working for me. Let's just slam the ground in front of the Viking, stunning. Okay. Left button, we'll do that now. Nice. What do you do? Stop. All right, this time. War. War never changes. Thank the gods for that. Ah. Love it. What are you? Just a big ball floating around, huh? Alright. Mysterious body parts to collect. Nice. Need a key for that. Oh. <laughs> Take your time. I'm open forever. Wow. Overdoing the sales there. No, no. War no. never changes. What? Thank the gods for that. Oh my gosh. Oh. 
Adoratus te Christe. Get out of here. What's the purpose of that? Still collecting body parts, good. I think I could do the body part collection better than the other quest that I had. Crystal key needed. Oh, now it's short. All right, here we go. We're on our way, folks. We're on our way. Fear not. Bring it. Bring it. I'm not scared. Hero Siege. It's actually a lot of fun. You've got to level up your character, kill a bunch of things, get your equipment better, go out there, kill more hordes of monsters. Really, really fun game. Go check it out. Leave your comments below. Let me know if you've checked out Hero Siege. Is it the type of game that you're going to play? And until next time, get out there and fill your brains. Don't forget to subscribe.